The simple truth is Ducati's 796 slots nicely between the first timer Monster 696 and the more powerful Monster 1100 and it's one of biking's easy to net pleasures. It's not under R overpowered, not expensive to buy second hand or maintain, easy to ride and a looker to boot. Plus it carries one of the most recognizable brand names ever on its fuel tank, Ducati. Showing non-adjustable forks and the usual Saks rear shock are a serious partnership they're tuned to work together so perfectly. Ok, so fast riding over bumps produces uppercut punches to the buttocks, but the first ride was on Italian roads that are far worse than the UK's. Thankfully Ducati's monster design team has seen the light and started to move the wide one-piece tapered handlebar up and away from the front wheel spindle. There's still an amount of body weight propped on the wrists but it's better and picking up the pace gives instant relief. An agile chassis that gives feedback a plenty front and rear makes for a purposeful road chaser, in or out of town. All the requisites of a medium-sized air-cooled V-twin are here in the Monster 796's 803cc engine. A rolling mist of torque stretches across the rev range and is topped with an acceptable level of horsepower that won't scare freshly licensed riders or bore veterans of 130 bhp and more. There are more details involved in making the 796 an enjoyable riding experience, 1 light throttle action, 2. Boombastic reverb from the airbox on the overrun, 3. Quality throttle response, and 4 it handles. The Monster 696 and 1100 are sorted machines that have revealed no major concerns for owners or potential buyers. This way of thinking surely applies to the 796. Aesthetically, Ducati's constant battle to boost build quality shows with every new model wiring and frame clips are mostly out of view, tip top coating finish. Shame about the piss poor mirror mounts that can come loose in the breeze. On the face of it the 796 comes with very little by the way of toys or gizmos. However, the LCD race replica dash while tasty is nothing new in Ducativille. Like the sporting 1098-1198 bikes the monster carries a facility to record and download to computer throttle position, revs, gear selected etc. via an accessory device. 